Hey water signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and those of you that are cross-watching, welcome to your Tarot Life Messages. Today we're going to take a look at and see what went through their mind the first time that they saw you here. So we'll go ahead and see what your um, special person, your crush, your romantic interest here, what were their initial thoughts and their first impressions of you. This is going to be a general reading guys so please just keep that in mind if you are after a personalized tarot reading with myself please feel free to reach out and inquire i will list my email address just below the video here otherwise let's go ahead and begin Wow, okay, and bottom of the deck you have the Nine of Cups energy here. Um, from the moment that they've laid eyes on you here, they knew that you were going to be uh, someone truly special. This is someone who, I feel like this is even love at first sight. I feel like this is someone whom almost, it feels like they instantly fell in love with you from the moment that they laid eyes on you it's this instant connection this instant attraction that they felt towards you here so much so that I feel like a part of them was fighting was trying to fight really hard this attraction this chemistry that they felt it felt electrifying you know you even if you think back to the first time that you guys met each one another this person kept looking up at you like they would um look up at you and then notice that you're looking and then avert their gaze and then they look back to you and you still have their eyes locked on you this is someone who couldn't stop looking I feel like this was someone who was in awe of you they were definitely very attracted to you on a physical level um, they thought that you were extremely beautiful very attractive here they thought it's almost like you were a picture from a magazine okay they're very attracted to like you have the type of look that they're typically attracted to um, it was it's definitely something in the eyes I'm getting blue eyes so I don't know if you have blue eyes or if your person has blue eyes it was just they couldn't help but look away it felt like they were drowning or lost in your eyes or you were drowning in their eyes here yeah. they were definitely captivated by your beauty here with the queen of cups energy and I feel like from the very moment that they saw you here they knew that you are someone that they could grow to love or they instantly saw themselves fell themselves falling in love with you here I also feel like this person remembers, um, vividly remembers your first kiss or the first time you guys locked eyes or the first time that you, you both uh, held or touched one another. It also feels like you stole their heart here. They felt... They felt like you were the most attractive person that they had ever seen. And it's almost like it felt very poetic that that instant that your eyes locked across a crowded room or that instant that they looked up and you guys exchanged that glance. It felt like their heart had whispered here, you know, he or she, that's it, they're the one. This is the one here. It's like instantly you took, you stole their breath, you stole their heart here.
I felt like this person was also very nervous and I get that the energy here between the two of you was electrifying it was definitely very palpable that even if there may have been like you guys may have been in a crowded room with one another but what's happened is it feels like you guys just filtered everyone out and it, it's almost as if everyone else around you was non-existent it was just the two of you and that what you felt that surge of electricity that electrifying energy they felt it too and even if you were in a room with other people they they would have seen that and they would have picked up on that because the energy feels so palpable so much so that it's perceptible by other people in the room here they never they'll never forget the first time they saw you and how crazy they were about you them and even how crazy about uh, you that they may be now I do feel like there is something here that feels like it may have been it may have gotten in the way of your connection with this person because I get that they're trying to fight their feelings and I feel like this person the more that the two of you have seen each other the more that you guys have communicated I feel like the more those feelings have intensified and grew over time the more and more that they saw themselves falling in love with you I do feel like you're like a dream or a wish come true with this person you're someone that like you check a lot of their boxes you're someone that they have absolutely fallen in love with or you're someone that they are lusting out over you are someone that they fantasize about with you reside in their um, deepest fantasies and their most secret imaginations here i do feel like you're you have all the qualities not only the looks but the qualities the traits and the characteristics that they seek for in a partner it's almost like you've you know it's almost like they've imagined you to life. That's how they feel about you. So it feels like you're a wish come true. This is too good to be true. They're also very nervous to... You get them very nervous and they're scared to act around you here. Um, it's like they're trying to... I don't know what they're working on. What is it that they're working on? Is it because this person uses their hands here for a living? Um, or is it because they're trying to work on something? Maybe they're trying to work on approaching you or opening up to you or they're trying to work on, you know, building this connection here. This is someone, if you have met in some sort of professional setting, then I do feel like this is someone who is scared to cross any boundaries. But I see that they are doing cyber stalking on you. I feel like this person is trying to, you know, do a Google search on you and trying to get as much information as they can about you. They are so intrigued. You have blown their mind. This is someone who wants to know every little thing about you. There is, I feel like they're fighting their emotions and they're fighting their attraction towards you. And this is why I feel like maybe this is someone who is in a relationship with someone else. They're already committed, but hey, you know, the heart, what it want, the heart wants what it wants. And there's there's no denying chemistry like this, let me tell you. They can't ignore it, you can't ignore it, you feel it. For some of you, I feel like it's this unspoken sexual tension that neither of you speak about, but you feel it. And maybe it's because you don't want to cross boundaries. Maybe it's this professional setting, it's a workplace setting, or you're their client, or they're your client. But it feels like they're really trying very hard to pull back their own, their attraction towards you, or not act on this attraction here. There's this explosion of emotions, there's this eruption of passion that I'm seeing. I feel like this is someone who is doing a lot of fantasizing about you. This is someone who thinks about you um, a lot of the time here. This is someone who I feel like wants to get close and intimate with you. But there, it's more than just a physical attraction. This person feels like you're so familiar or you guys are so similar that you kind of just get one another and each time that you talk or each time that you're around one another it's like they fall deeper and more madly in love with you here this feels very intense and it'll be interesting to see how this all pans out because i just feel like look the chalice here this vessel isn't able to contain all the richness of emotions that this person feels for you it's overflowing okay so I feel like it's only a matter of time before you know something happens here before they open themselves up or before they act on their attraction here all right guys and these are your messages so thank you as always for watching and listening please share your support by liking sharing and subscribing to the channel you guys are manifesting each other I feel like this person is really trying to manifest you or you're doing on 
you're doing some manifestation on them you're trying to manifest this person in your life or manifest a relationship or a connection with them i feel like the both of you are working at this that's interesting 